What's up, y'all? It's C Foul Kicks, and I'm back with another video. So I know I've been MIA for a little bit. Uh, within that time frame, a lot of things has changed. I'm in my own place now. As y'all can see, the scenery is a bit different. I'm still trying to set up uh, lighting and get that all worked out, get some new lights so I can uh, put out some better quality videos. Uh, but um, what better shoe to come back with than the Jordan 11 72 and 10s? So these were released on December 12th. Um, they, actually, they actually pushed up the date. They were scheduled to release December 18th. If y'all if know the correct date, go ahead, correct me in the, uh, in the comments field. But uh, they pushed them up. I actually did pick up the Maroon 6s, but uh, yeah, those uh, that that really screwed over a lot of people. Maroon 6s retail for 220. These also retail uh, retail for 220. So yeah, that just might be a preview of how much uh, how much uh, Jordans might cost next year, y'all. So just take note. It it might just be a little quick preview. So we might need to get used to that 220 uh, price tag. But uh, yeah, as I said. Um, they released on the 12th. The release was bananas, you know, in store, online, straight crazy. Uh, even though a lot of stores are only doing raffles, people are still lining up outside the stores trying to get sneakers, but <laughs> they just told them that we're doing raffles. So um, I was able to grab my pair through a raffle through Foot Locker. You know, actually, that's the second time I actually won a raffle at that same Foot Locker. So I guess I'm, I'm pretty lucky. Um, I did try to get another pair online. But as I said before, it was bananas. Wasn't able to get through with anything. But I heard a lot of people were actually successful getting them online. Um, just off the fact that rumored is that there were a million pair of these made. A million pairs of these made. <laughs> um, and with that being said, a million pairs being made, they the resale price isn't as high as y'all seen 11s in the past. So that, that's a good thing. Um, it, a lot a much better chance for everyone to secure their pair not for a, a crazy price um, all y'all kids out there that, that actually want these your parents can pretty much give you money and y'all can just get these alone for Christmas not a bad thing I don't know y'all y'all have to figure it out on y'all own if that's if that's a good enough gift but uh let's actually get into the shoe so y'all can go ahead and put me down for the record that I'm gonna say that these are the best quality Jordan 11s that that has ever been made best quality and when I mean by quality you can actually just feel the weight of the shoe just a simple weight of the shoe just just tells you that that the quality is there um, they definitely use a uh, better quality materials than, than any other 11s that that I've actually had or or that I've seen um, as you can see the top half of the shoe is majority uh, tumbled leather and I'll say the, the leather is pretty much equivalent to the leathers that came on the uh, the Oreo fours that I released earlier this year um, around the back half of the shoe, they have an embossed uh, Jumpman that's in red. You know, it's not stitched in, it's embossed in, so it's not going anywhere. They have, it's on, pretty much on a felt material that's back here. It's like a felt suede material. And the 23 that's on the back is actually stitched on. So in previous years, they actually had them ironed on. They're actually, it's actually stitched on. All right, so let me actually see if I get a good close up. As y'all can see, that 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 patent leather they actually made it a tumbled patent leather, which is crazy. Never actually seen that that technique done before, but uh, I appreciate it. And as y'all can see, while I'm close up, you can see all the glitter and all that in there, which isn't too bad. It's all pretty much the same glitter that's on the uh, the on the uh, Aqua Eights, which I also have to do a review for y'all on those. But uh, just getting into the details of the shoe, on the inside of the shoe with uh, actually a different message now. Let me actually get it nice and close. Lighting ain't that good. Sorry about that. All right, so let me tell y'all what it says. Inspired by the most historic season led by the greatest player ever. So they definitely switched up the, the message that, that's on the, uh, the back of the shoe. 
But as I said, nonetheless, the shoe is uh, is great. You know, um, uh, you can also refer to this as the uh, Christmas crack. Everybody wants these. People that don't even buy Jordans, this is what they're looking for. If you know, what I mean, I'm 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 getting calls from people saying, "Yeah, I'm about to about to get the Jordans coming out the 11s." I'm like, "But you don't even buy Jordans." But <laughs> this is what they want. Um, as y'all can see in the background, the box is pretty much uh, the standard Jordan 11 box as you see each year. See, I probably get y'all a close up on uh, what came inside the box uh, through a B roll. But yeah, nonetheless, this is a dope shoe. I like the color blocking on the shoe, very similar to the. Uh, to the Cyber Monday ones, I, I think they have an official name, but th that's what I know them as. White on the upper half of the shoe, black on the upper half of the shoe, and on the bottom half of the shoe, from the sole and the midsole on down, it's white. So it's a nice uh, color blocking scheme. Um, if you actually look at the bottom of the shoe, we don't, we didn't, we're not actually getting the icy sole, but we got more of a milky translucent sole. So people were saying that they were getting their pairs and they're already yellowed. I don't know how these are gonna age but just by looking at them I don't think it's gonna be too bad and, and I kind of I kind of like the the milky white so if that, if that even makes sense milky white uh, very similar to the soles that's on the uh, that's on the maroon sixes which, which are also dope very that's also a very dope shoe I also get y'all a, a review of that but yeah nonetheless you know this is a very dope shoe y'all very dope very dope as y'all can look on the tongue you can see that the Jumpman, <clears throat> they also have the uh, Jordan Jumpman, that's what it says there. For those that, that don't know, you could probably see that, uh, you could probably see it close on the B roll with the red Jumpman. Alright, probably get y'all a closer B roll of the laces. One lace says 72, the other lace says 10. So 72 and 10. So, yeah, y'all. I think that's pretty much going to wrap up this review. If y'all like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Tell me how I'm doing in the comments feel. If you didn't like the video, you know what I mean? Still give it a thumbs up. <laughs> and uh, until the next time, y'all. Peace. Dance all love me everything. Dance all love me everything. Dance all love me everything. Tumbleys, mini bongs, mini bongs, yeah. Every bad man and every dog, yeah. I agree with your boss, yeah, boss, yeah, boss. So the rum said, yeah. You look better than Beyonce. Girl, I pray you me be a big one with a dunce. Me a the oxygen for your lungs, eh. Make you speak in a tongue, eh. Dance all, can't stop. Forever, ah, ever dance all, can't stop. Dance all, can't stop. Forever, ah, ever dance all, can't stop. Dance all can style, 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 dance all can I feel you have rum for the team, yeah Tell everybody say you're free for coming, yeah Dance all, can't stop Forever, ah, ever Dance all, can't stop Dance all, can't stop Forever, ah, ever Dance all, can't stop Dance all, can't stop Dance all, can't stop Dance all, can't stop